Hello everyone, welcome to Boxing Block Center. And please, if you're new to this channel, make sure you click the like and the subscribe button right now, man. And for as well, go to the notification bell icon. Click it and sell all sorts of drop in your banger. A new exclusive video. You will definitely be notified. So, Dillian the Body Snatcher White has been going hard on Andrews Jr. And this time around, he came out with a very, let's say, partially credible statement. We don't know yet because Andrews Jr. still has a long way to go. You know, he has a long career ahead of him, a long road uh, to work through. So, we'll see what happens though. Why said Andy Reese might be another Boston Douglas? Shine ones and does it. Let's take a look at this comment right here. So, I quote He's still a big draw in the every division, but I think Andy Reese might be another Boston Douglas. Shine ones and does it, you know, because of the lifestyle that is enjoyed. Wow, that's a very like interesting statement from Dylan Wido. Um, Olajide, your take on that, bro? Oh, um, Dylan Royce, yeah. Well, it's gonna be down to under Royce to prove Dylan Wai, not just Dylan Wai, to prove himself wrong because the way the rules seem to be moving doesn't look like you know Dillion is not the first person to say and the rules might end up being the next Douglas you know because on the normal ground I pay and the rules okay you've been you've been craving for a fight a war title you add one you lost your claim you lost because you're meant to win the fight you had to win out the fight okay you but you lost the fight you got another one. You won it by chance. You had the rematch. You lost it. I expect him to kind of like look into challenging himself a lot more. Try to, you know, build up a f profile to at least get a more title fight again. But instead, it's more like Ruiz is kind of like pulling out away from a fight that can actually get you another more title shot again. And it's like, okay. I mean, what are you trying to do? And that's pretty much why a couple of boxing experts are looking into really like, are you going to be another Douglas? Or what exactly is he really trying to do? So in that world, we don't know yet if that could be true, but it's left to Ruiz now to kind of like genuinely, you know, prove himself and show this is my worth. It wasn't just a fluke. And you know stuff like that, and just shut his mouth and get into work, and you know pull out some things. I'm not gonna say more than that. Thanks, brother. I appreciate it as usual. Um, to Jagway. Yeah, man. Yeah, take on this, bro. Andy Ruiz, man. Jesus, this guy. Have to go on and on about what is wrong with this guy and what he's lacking there's so many things let me just point some serious facts here aj knew what was in front of him when he lost the rematch that's why he went into the immediate rematch um not a lot of people can accomplish what aj did in, in less than five weeks of defeating andrew Ruiz. a lot of champions have not come back from a win like that, some wait a year to 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 to, to fight Andrew Ruiz and beat him. What AJ did is a is a huge accomplishment. I mean, let's look at um, uh, Lennox Lewis and Rahman, uh Hasim Rahman. That took I forgot. I think that took at least a year or three years, if I'm not mistaken, for him to even get the belt back. Uh, I seen Rockman was like going back and forth with the belt, like you know, going to court trying to do this. It was just a whole. It was just a crazy mess, you know. A whole. A lot of these champions couldn't do what a lot of these AJ, what AJ did. Andrew Ruiz is for a, a, a fact, you know. You got to wonder what he's thinking mentally. What what he, what he's what, what what's going on in his head? Okay, you're a champion. 
you know, a champion at that, who, who holds majority of the belts. Okay, what what what, what possesses you to to not train? I believe Andrew Reese trained, you know, because if he didn't train, why would we be why would we be lied to from his uh, sparring partner? Why? It doesn't make sense. So I believe he trained. He just thought he could use what he did in the same match, you know. And I tried to do it again, repeat it because he thought, you know, he figured AJ out. Okay, try to try to hit AJ in, in the same spot. Try to uh, very sneakily, always come down with that with that right hand in the back of people's head, like he always does every fucking fight. He always does it, you know. Goes to the body, you know, to the chin, and then that right hand, which is uh, like, uh, like 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 an open palm, really, and goes to the back of the head. He does it every single time. He mixes it in. You know, you gotta wonder why he does that. Is Andrew Ruiz a champion? Or is he? A, 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 what kind of mindset does he have? Switching trainers from trainers. Is is it the trainer or is it Andy Ruiz? And I a hundred percent believe it's Andy Ruiz. Don't forget, he was uh, he was with um, uh, I believe it was uh, the, who's that trainer uh, Garcia, that trainer. I can't remember his. I can't remember the, his name off the top of my head. His, uh, I believe it was something Garcia. That was his first trainer, and then he went to Manny Robles, and then after Manny Robles, what do you say Manny Robles cutting off you? He got you that belt that far, you know. What are you saying he can't offer you? Now you're going to uh, Reynoso, which I don't. I, I don't trust this camp, you know. This guy, the uh, his camp. Yeah, the way they trade, I, I feel like, uh, 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 you know, his camp take a lot of PDs, so I don't trust that camp. So what, 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 Andrew? I believe I, I hundred percent believe Andrew Ruiz is another Buster Douglas, you know, like AJ knew it. AJ hundred percent knew it. If I defeat this guy, they're not gonna give me my props, and they did until this day. They're trying to avoid. Oh, he ran in the ring, this and that, blah blah blah. Really. So that's what AJ meant. You guys are not going to give him what he deserves. But Andrew Ruiz want, now wants to, wants to. oh, I won one, you won one. Let's run it back. You got to think about it. Why would you even say that? You haven't even earned it, bro. You have not earned it. You but you have to fight Dominic Brazil, Ortiz, uh, 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 F.A. Jago, um, uh, some of those PBC fighters. You know, Jarrell Miller. You you have to fight those guys before you even say you earned another shot at AJ. Because let's be honest, you have not done shit for the heavyweight division. AJ blessed you, and I'm tired of your fans. Yes, I'm tired of your Mexican fans who think you earned another title shot. You you haven't earned it, man. Go go fight some of those PBC fighters. Take care of the pond over there before you want to take care of the pond over in the UK. All he wants is another quick cash grab. Uh, um, uh, uh, Dylan White offered you money, but you refused it. You want you are, what are you refusing? What don't you believe in? You are you were a champion. You took out Anthony Joshua. What else do you want? Now Dylan White's offering you money, but he before he even took the uh, uh, Povetkin Povetkin fight, he said, "Let's take, let's run it back." Bro, your 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 stocks are not even that much. Uh, um, 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 Andrew Ruiz, your stock plummeted after you lost to AJ. You know, because you remind everybody of a Buster Douglas. Don't say you didn't train. You trained. You just thought you could do the same shit to AJ. A well prepared AJ. AJ told you what he was gonna do. You just thought you could do the same shit again, and you did it. So let's let's not get ahead of ourselves. You have not done shit for the heavyweight division. You know, you need to you need to put in your time. Like AJ said, clean hearts always win in the end. And I believe Andy Ruiz is not doesn't have a clean heart. He has one agenda, and that agenda is money. And that money has made him soft with everything that he has bought so far. I've seen what he has bought, and I'm surprised he has been, he's not broke or he owes money. You know, the seven million he got from AJ. You know, he's got to break that off for the camp. You know, his trainers. 
So let's let, let, come on. Who who is he kidding here? Who is he kidding? Andrew Ruiz just wants a quick cash grab and thinks he is the he is he is a B side and all this. Bro, uh, uh, Dylan White has is the A side. If you're gonna fight, go straight into the Dylan White fight. I don't know what you're waiting for. I don't know what kind of miracle you're waiting for to get to get hyped up for a fight, but. It has to be Dylan White and it has to be a good fighter. It cannot be no Chris Ariola. It cannot be no cab driver. Because you know, you know, he knows damn well his stock is trash. And that's where I'm going to leave it. Thanks, brother. I appreciate it. So, for those of you guys that are watching right now, make sure you like the video, share, subscribe as usual. And go follow me right on social media platforms, on my streaming platform on Facebook at Boxing Block Center, Twitter at boxing block and instagram at boxing block center you can also uh contact me via whatsapp but uh free to do that go to my facebook page and you see that boxing block center there stay blessed guys cheers